Okay, so I had to do a clean install of Create without any add-ons just because there seems to be a bit of issues with add-ons and flywheel and uh, version incompatibility issues. So this is just only the Create mod with no add-ons, but this is a pretty easy way to make an elevator. Um, besides getting the actual resources, an elevator is one of the in my opinion, one of the easiest things to set up and create. You just need your power source, a uh, redstone contact for each floor, and then one for the actual elevator itself. Uh, depending on if you put it at the bottom of the elevator or the top of the elevator, if you do like a full box, that will change where you put it on the pillar so it lines up with each floor properly. Then you need your building blocks, you need super glue, your elevator pulley. The contraption control will allow you to m move the elevator between floors from inside the elevator. And then you could also have redstone links. Redstone links, if they are n set up near the redstone contact with a redstone signal, then you can call the elevator to the floor rather than it being stuck at the floor where you last put it. And then I have doors in my inventory just to demonstrate that if you have your doors like this, where they are together in the elevator, it will, in my experience, having doors in the elevator will, like, crash your game in single player. And on servers, it won't necessarily crash you, but it will kick you out because of a packet issue. I, I think it's a packet issue because it'll just time you out rather than crashing the whole server or the whole game. But to get this set up, I'm just going to do a basic box here. And I'm going to do the redstone contact just right here at the bottom. And then I want one right there want it to line up like that I think and that no come on it's a lot easier to set up with just blocks okay you want the redstone actually facing towards where you want it to go I'm just gonna do two of these as a demonstration it's not set up equally but it'll it'll get the job done your contraption controls in the elevator then near the top you just want this over it you don't really have to center it but you want to put your elevator pulley down and I'm not gonna put the creative motor on just yet let's do redstone links here And let's just get some blocks for it. So I think this one I can just use these, and then the wood, and then the grass, and then shift right click all of the, the links that are connected directly, because that will set them to a receiving signal. And then you can have the redstone links set up the corresponding ones like this and this one's wood and then you get the last one and you can, you can basically place these wherever um, like wherever is convenient as long as you use the redstone links which actually makes it pretty nice to make it compact and actually able to look nice, I guess. I, I don't know a good way to word that is. It, it's able to hide the actual redstone and contraptions and stuff. You can also double layer the elevator so you can't see the redstone contacts or anything as well. If you do want doors, I recommend doing just another layer right outside of the elevator on each floor like this. And then just put the door 
right in that gap instead. But now you want to, after you have your elevator set up, you have to make sure you get each corner. You want to right click one corner and then go to the complete opposite. And it should have the entire thing hooked up with the super glue. Now, I put the creative motor on, and then you right click the elevator pulley. Sorry, I lagged for a second, but now that this is on and I've right clicked this, it has attached to the elevator, and the elevator has essentially become an entity. You, when you place blocks, it actually can't interact with the elevator itself, and sometimes it'll place in the blocks, so you have to right click the elevator pulley again just to be able to adjust the actual names here and I think uh, maybe it's not if you right click them okay I set it up a bit wrong both of the red redstone signal areas need to be facing each other from the elevator to the actual contact that you're using so now if I right click it there we go it activates and this turns into half of a rose quartz lamp and now that I, uh, I think you can also, yeah, you can shift right click it and change the name of the elevator. But now you can select which floor it's on. And the redstone contacts will always meet each other. So you can decide, design the building or the elevator based on how you want it to be set up. And that says unreachable. Yeah, that's unreachable because the elevator pulley and engine are actually in the way it's too tall so you have to keep that in mind when building these but now i should be able to jump down and press this button with the redstone link and the elevator will actually come down as well once you get a hold of it it's actually pretty easy to set up the the resources are the only like struggle and it's it's pretty useful for builds i'm not sure about practicality because there are other mods that add other things but if you want to use just create it's a great way to save space while having a pretty vertical building um it's also good for if you want to like use the lost cities mod and live in one of the buildings in those but uh yeah it's just, pretty simple elevator tutorial uh, i messed up a little bit at the at the start but hopefully hopefully this helps